Buy my shirt. Buy my shirt. Buy my hat. Buy it all. Come watch me stream. Yeah. Everybody, um, this is a video I literally never thought I'd have to film, and I don't even want to, but I don't know what's ahead, and if I suddenly stop posting, I don't want people being like, what the fuck? Um, but as you can tell by the title, I tested positive for Corona virus. Um, <sighs> um, I don't, I feel embarrassed, I feel angry, um, I, I got tested today because I was going to film with somebody who I hope will still want to film with me in the future, um, and so because of that I obviously, anybody I see, I make sure we get tested, the very few people I do see and have seen. The reason I got tested was because I was going to film a video with somebody today that is, I was, it's like the only video I was, that I've been looking forward to filming in the last four months, I feel. Um, and I was super excited and because we were filming together and we both quarantined, I asked that we both get tested and because it was for a video, I filmed it. I have literal footage of me getting tested positive twice with corona. So it's 9.37 in the morning. It is the day of my video shoot with So lately I don't do anything with people that aren't also quarantining seriously and don't get tested before. I feel very fortunate to be able to spend $125 a test and get the answers 15 minutes later. All right, we are pulling in. Ooh. Oh my god, can you guys take this $125 a test and, I don't know, repave the driveway? For this test, I don't actually have to leave my car, which is amazing. It's perfect if you're paranoid like me. You guys saw me get tested before I went to Oregon. I'm not afraid to show this part. I think a lot more influencers should show this part. Yeah, I just want to show this because I have nothing to hide. I don't think I have a reason to have COVID. So yes, I understand that this probably looks confusing of me telling everybody to take this seriously. This is an opportunity that came up that I would really like to take, especially after nine months of doing all of this. Oh my god, there is a man outside my car with a Blue Lives Matter mask on. I mean, at least he's wearing a- Oh my god, he has a Blue Lives Matter phone case! This is fan behavior for a fucking police department! Who cares? It is gonna be really awkward if I test positive. I mean, I literally don't know what I would test positive from, but like, wow, that would suck. This is the- this video is like the only thing getting me through this week. I'm positive that I'm one negative bitch. <laughs> mask over the mouth still. Yeah, please. This is like my only thing I do in quarantine. <laughs> it's like a spa treatment. Go ahead, let me check your temperature right now, thank you. Okay, good, 98.6. Oh, great, I was gonna say. It's gonna be in the right nostril first, then the left, okay? All right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And then you guys will bring the results to my car, right? Totally. Cool. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. That one was, I was being a little dramatic, but that one really did not hurt that bad. It was honestly probably the gentlest one I've got. It's really insane when I think about it that these rapid tests are $125 that have to come out of our pockets and like the government isn't providing them. We have this technology. We have this ability. What the fuck? You know, oh, I can't get into it. <laughs> it's too early. Really? Oh. You're positive. Really? I swear. I ran the test twice, too. I'm pot. Can I get another test? You want to buy another test? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. I don't know how I'm literally positive. It's 125. Okay. Sorry. No, that's. I ran the test twice and it's both came back positive. I'm like shook. So, um, have you been out? No. Yeah. That's why I'm like. Not visiting? Anybody saw you? No. Shopping? No. Grocery store? 
form that you know right now, your symptoms are minimal. Okay. Which is the key thing. So I would just stay calm, stay relaxed. Okay. And then um, if you did get in contact with anyone the last 72 hours, just let them know. Just not panicking. Just say I'm having a little symptoms. I tested positive, but I didn't expect it. Okay. I'm doing another test. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> this is literally so, so unfair. I'm getting another test just to make sure because false positives are a thing. <sighs> so unfair. This is so unfair. So I took another test and it came back positive. <laughs> and I So upset as if we can fucking see. It's just <laughs> this just doesn't feel fair at all. I feel literally fine. I he checked for a fever. I don't have a fever. I don't <sighs> I'm just angry and I feel embarrassed and stupid and <laughs> angry I'm just so angry this just doesn't feel fair I don't go anywhere I don't like see anyone without getting tested first and them getting tested <laughs> I got tested 13 days ago and was negative and have been nowhere since I don't I just don't get it it's not fair it's just not fair I'm honestly happy that I'm done crying, but but I just wanted to make this video. I considered myself having taken this super seriously, um, and here I am. Wear a fucking mask. Like, <sighs> fuck. But yeah, um, if my uploading is uh, inconsistent, that's why I'm dealing with this shit. Love you guys. Stay safe. Stay home if you don't need to go out. Wear a mask. Get tested regularly. <sighs> I don't have any advice. Clearly mine didn't work. Now that I've calmed down a little bit, I just wanted to give a little bit more. I actually woke up, I woke up on my birthday feeling sick and I was like, oh my god, I have corona. And I went and got tested and it was negative, though I haven't really done anything. I haven't been anywhere. Um, and I have no symptoms. I don't have a fever. Never really know. So you could be walking around and have it and not even know, which is why it's important to wear masks. It's important to get tested if you can. Um, it's important to just not do anything you don't need to do. I think I'll be fine. I hope so. Um, I obviously smoke a lot of weed. Which not only makes me cool, but um, worried about <laughs> worried about uh, complications. Claudia and Phineas invited me to spend Thanksgiving with them, and I'm not doing that. And I've been looking forward to that for forever since Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday. You know, it's just a bunch of frost world problems that makes this hard. I'm thankful for my health. I'm just mad, mostly mad. Mad at the bitches I see not wearing masks. Mad at the bitches I see going out to fucking dinner. Partying. It just makes me so mad. It's like nine months of my life I've put on hold. Only to get the thing I was trying to avoid. I'm just worried about my mental health at this point. I mean, wear a fucking mask and don't go anywhere that you don't need to go. I don't know how many times I can fucking say that nine months into a goddamn pandemic that the entire world is affected by. I don't. <sighs> I'm most likely just in denial and have COVID, but I really, it's like, I have just spent the day <laughs> crying and also rattling my brain. I know rapid tests are more inclined to show false positives. I don't know if two false positives, but, but I'm at Dodger Stadium. I get these results tomorrow and I'm just really just so hoping I don't have this fucking virus. So it is the end of the day and I am waiting on two more test results and 
Um, obviously, uh, my two positive test results were from rapid tests, and rapid tests have a high percentage of inaccuracy. So I got two that have a lot more, um, a lot more behind the results. So I'm waiting on those. I should get those back in the next 48, just like 72 hours. But I'm just quarantining in my bedroom. I have my vitamin C shit. I have my echinacea. My oil of oregano. A bunch of forks and towels so I can eat delivery. I have a way of going to the outside that isn't the front door and I don't have to go through any common areas. I definitely am trying to like relax, play it easy and not if I, do, I don't feel sick, so I don't want to stress my body out and then get myself sick, especially if this shit is coming up in tests. So I just took a bath. I feel really, I mean, it's fucked up that my biggest concern isn't my health because I feel fine. My biggest concern is, will everybody like fucking look at me different? Like I just, I have so many other concerns that are so stupid. So, I mean, I just, I feel very lucky to basically have a studio apartment as a bedroom. Ugh, I hope none of this came across as, like, woe is me. I know there's way bigger issues going on, especially if this is a false positive, but this is my life. This video wasn't even supposed to go this route. I didn't account for this. So yeah, I, don't, I hope this doesn't come across like tone deaf. Um, this is literally my experience. This video, like I said, was never supposed to be like this. I'm really trying not to sit here and be angry. I'm trying to be optimistic, but it's, I just don't understand where I could have gotten this. It's like been, like today has been the most insane day. It hasn't felt real. I just don't get it. I mean, apparently I did. But I just don't get it. Stay tuned, stay inside, wear a mask. Just like, dude, like this affects people.